You lose fellowship with your wife, then you have broken home. You lose fellowship with the Holy Spirit, you will leave broken church. Church should be born, should be grown up in the Holy Spirit. So, oh, from that time, every morning when I get up, I say, Good morning, dear Holy Spirit. Today, you and I are going to bring the love of God, grace of Jesus Christ, to the people around us. Dear Holy Spirit, let's go. And when I prepare the message, dear Holy Spirit, you know the message, Rhema. And please give me the Rhema so that I may carry the message to the people. Then when I come to the place where I say, Holy Spirit, let's go, let's go. And while I preach in my heart, I cry to the Holy Spirit, Speak the Lord, blow like a mighty wind in my spirit. Give me the wisdom, knowledge, discernment, power, ability to get across thy message to the heart of people. Then some wonderful thing happened. I begin to feel new dimension of the power and anointing. Then the 3,000 membership wall was broken down. My church was flying towards 6,000, 8,000, 12,000. Then we moved to another part of the city. Now we have 750,000 membership. 